Right guys, how's it going? We're back, finally, and as you can see, my best stash locations. That's where we're at. In my experience in playing Daisy, I am an absolute grub, and I know brilliant stash locations, and I'm gonna go through them with you just now, but as you can see, the cinematic server is here. We finally got that camera out, and we can really put it to good use. So, let's jump straight in and show you these locations. Okay, so first stash spot, we are all the way on the left hand side of the map, out to the edge of the map, and of course there's that huge river that runs all the way from top to bottom. Now, there's so many stash spots in this river, all you have to know is the secret ingredients you need for grubbing out here. As you can see, we're camping out, we're out in the sticks, and we're going to be focusing on these little gullies here where the rocks are, now as you can see, you pop in there, Get your crate. Now we're going to be focusing on crates and sea crates. Barrels, tents, none of that wackaroni stuff. Real grubs know that crates are the way to go. All right, pop it in the water there. As you can see, we've got a lot of cover. So when you're grubbing, looking at your other stash, number one rule of grubbing, don't get out grubbed when you're stashing. You have to be the top grub, ladies and gentlemen. As you can see, there's lots of cover when you're on the stash there on the left and on the right. Obviously, you can see how covered this stash is. Okay, next couple of stash bots. We're at Polkovo, ladies and gentlemen. I love this town. Big fan. First stash bot in Polkovo. We're going to head on over past the farm towards Zub Castle. You see it in the distance there. Now, these trees we're gonna focus on. This little church, come to here, and on the left, these particular trees here. We're gonna pop in here, I'm gonna show you the stash. Now, as you guys can see, as we're coming up to it, this thing is almost invisible. There's our crate, stack them up high, put as many in there as you want, make sure they're nice and neat, so that no of the corners are hanging out. So as you can see, these three trees here, you're gonna wanna come to, they're all bunched up together. There's not that many like this on the map, as far as I'm aware. And obviously you're not too far from spawn as well. As you can see, there's just no way someone's seen that. I'm gonna zoom out a bit just to so show you the area, because this bit is, um, once again, quite tricky to get to. So those three trees there, you got the tree line on the left, on the right, the little church is there, Pulkova right there, and Green Mountain as well. We're gonna head to the next spot, just up the hill. I'm gonna pop up here. And as you can see, Puck over there, Green Mountain in the distance, Kozloka and Cherno just over the ridge there. So once again, quite close to this one. Head down into this forest. This one's even more tricky to find. Log piles there for reference. Kind of want to head towards Kozlovka direction from Polkovo when you get into this forest. Now, what you want to find is very important, this poor potty here in the middle of the woods. Okay, this is important to find the stash spot. So we're going to pop out here. I'm just going to show you once again. Puck over there, Green Mountain there. Kozlovka, Cherno off in the distance. When you spawn in, you're gonna wanna run, you're gonna wanna find this in, right in the woods, for reference. Right, now, pop behind it, right behind it here, you wanna go to this spot, look back towards almost pop over direction, and we're gonna run straight over here, and in particular, these trees are the ones we're looking for. Not quite as perfect as the last dash, but still more dense further in the forest. If that's what makes you more secure, or you feel more secure, go for it. This dash is for you. We're just going to show you what this looks like when it's got the crate inside, just so you can grub as hard as you want. Play it like an absolute rat. We'd love to see it. Look at that. Come on. No one's finding that, mate. Stacking them up nice and neat. Plenty of guns in there. Just got to run to Polkovo. Next location. Okay, this one is once again tricky to find. Gorka. We're at Gorka. Altar is over there. So in between Altar and Gorka, this large field. Now we're gonna come down the field in a moment here. Down the field. Now this area I believe is called Black Forest. Very dense, very dense. For reference, over here we have this green mustache in the middle of the woods. Single green mustache. Now we're gonna head up this river and come to where the kind of tree lines meet. Now as you can see, we've got this lovely, beautiful, ripe rat spot. For a stash in the water once again we love to see it we love to see it and obviously we're near gorka as a reference point in between shavlovka 
if I pronounce that right, and Gorka. So we're once again not too far from the coast to run here. And we're going to pop it under this tree here. It's quite a nice spot, I would say, because you've got cover from the left and the right from the tree. And the only main spot you got to worry about is up there if someone spots you. But I mean, who is walking out here, man? Who's coming down the hill there? As you can see, we popped it in the water, nice and neat. No one's seeing that, mate. Perfect spot for his stash. Okay, and last but not least, my favourite on the map, ladies and gentlemen. We are at Boar. You can see Zelenogorsk there off the distance. We've got Green Mountain, and over there is Kozlovka, and uh, where the two stashes ago we were just at. So, I'm going to pop down into Boar. Once again, another spawn ish town. And just look at this. This is Grub Central, ladies and gentlemen. I'm going to literally call this stream Grub Central. Look at it. Just stash location after stash location. And it is packed with woods. Look at it. Another one. Give us another one. There's another one, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to have another one. We're going to have another one. Are we going to get one more? We're going to get one more. And there's another one. Just for good measure. And just in case, there's another one. All these little ponds where you can put crates deep into the water. I'll show you how deep they go as well in, in a second here. The only thing you have to worry about this spot is the spawn locations. Obviously, you got spawns quite out, like around here. So people are going to be going inland to Zelenogorsk. They might pass you as you're on your stash. But obviously, it's deep forest. It's unlikely. There's nothing in the forest. That's a point of reference. Literally nothing. So as you can see, it's look how dense it is. That forest is huge, and it's right in the center. All these different pockets of ponds. I'm going to show you now. So you just pop in. Look at that. Lots of cover. Lots of hillside. If you get nice and low, it's unlikely you're going to get seen. Boom. Gone. Just like that. And you can stack tons. You don't even need to put it in the one pond. You can spread them out, man. Look at this. I'll try to get the cinematic, and I'll just show you how deep under the water the stash is. It's just premium. It's the best. It's the creme de la creme of grub spots, ladies and gentlemen. Look at it. Look how deep that is. Oh, mate. I'm grubbing out, seriously. Grub Central. We love a good stash. We love a good stash here at the channel. And look at that. Nice and deep. Out in the sticks. I'll link a video where I actually used this stash to attack Zelenogorsk on an official server way back to when, about eight months ago, I made that video. I'll try and link that in the top right of your screen. You can check it out um, and just see how strong these stashes are. But once again, guys, we are back. Cinematic server is up. I just want to say a quick thank you. Make sure to write a comment what you thought or other spots you know of. Leave a like to get in the algorithm. Comment and likes gets in the algorithm. Thank you. Catch you in a bit, boys.